Lindmar LMTV, Lindmar Television. Lindmar, your news starts now. Hey, Lindmar, it's Tuesday, May 10th, 2022. National Clean Your Room Day. Here's what's happening across the campus. A huge honor for a very special person at Lindmar. LMTV's Alec has that story. Congratulations to our school resource officer, Officer Dobbs. He received the 2022 Paul Draper Spirit of Marion Award. This award is given to a City of Marion employee who best represents dedication to public service and was awarded to him by the Mayor of Marion and the City Manager. Dobbs has been in the, with the Marion Police Department for 26 years. You'll see him both during the day and at many Limar sporting events cheering on the Lions while maintaining a safe environment. We'd like to give a hearty thank you to Officer Dobbs for his dedication to keeping both our school and community safe. Ian and Isabel, which I can't tell you apart, back to you. He really is the perfect person for that award. Thanks to him, and thanks, Jacqueline. <laughs> and other, oh, Alec! <laughs> in other news, how's that checklist going for prom? You know, dinner reservations and flowers, that kind of thing. Oh, but of course, the most important part, prom tickets. Did you get them this morning? No, but if not, it's not the end of the world. Elm uh. TV Sam has that story. Thanks, guys. Prom tickets went on sale this morning in the South Commons. If you missed out this morning, there are many more opportunities tomorrow and Thursday to get your tickets at the cheaper advanced price. Prom tickets bought in advance are $25 per person or $50 per couple. Tickets may also be purchased at the door the night of prom for $30 per person and $60 per couple. Tomorrow and Thursday, you can buy your tickets in the South Commons before school. If you have any obligations before school, you may also buy tickets from 12 to 2 tomorrow. And if none of that works for you, tickets will also be available Thursday and Friday from 3.30 to 4 in the main office. Remember, all fines must be paid and time made up in order to attend prom. If you have any questions about any of this, be sure to see Mrs. Crandall. That's all about prom. Guys, back to you. Thanks, Sam. It, speaking of prom, in case you didn't know this, it's this Saturday from 8 to 10.30 in the May Gym. The Grand March is in the auditorium at 7.30 p.m. Post-prom will begin at 11.30 p.m. at Game On Sports Complex in Cedar Rapids. We'll be back with more LMTV news right after this. Good morning, Lenmar. I want to make you aware of a popular event that's coming up here soon. Friday, May 13th, is the annual Soda Sand Volleyball Tournament. This will take place at Volleys on Blairs Ferry. If you're interested in this, make sure you see me. This tournament is open to all Lindmar students, so make sure you sign up soon to get your slot in this exciting event. Thank you. Welcome back. Seniors planning to pursue a career in education are welcome to attend Lindmar's Future Educator Signing Day on Monday, May 16th at 8.30 a.m. in the lecture hall. District officials will speak to you about employment opportunities at Lindmar and will guarantee you a future interview. If you're planning a career in agri-science, listen up. You should tour the Kirkwood Agricultural Science Department. Sign up with Ms. Limmer or Mrs. Bass in the College and Career Center. The tour will take place on Tuesday, May 17th from 8.30 to 1. Transportation and lunch will be provided. And those are the LMTV headlines at this hour. I'm Noel with Lindmar Sports. Congratulations to boys tennis. They won the district tournament for the 10th straight time. Tonight in Lindmar Sports, girls varsity tennis travels to Waller. Team dismissed at 2. Girls JV golf hosts a meet at Hunter's Ridge. Boys and girls JV won and varsity soccer face Prairie. The guys are here, the girls are there. Girls dismissed at 325. Boys JV2 Soccer faces Wash at Kingston. Team dismissed at 340. In other sports news, there will be a preseason meeting for new and returning athletes interested in participating in girls cross country. Monday morning at 8 in the South Commons. See you there. That's sports. Back to you. Thanks, Noah. In news from the counselors. Need a summer job? There are plenty of opportunities waiting for you on the job board. Check it out across from the main office. Now here's Bargaval with the Arts and Clubs. On the Arts and Clubs scene, the next chapter FFA meeting is Thursday morning at 8 o'clock. They'll be talking about Ag in the Park, Officer Elections, Chapter Banquet, and the Country Vegetable butter and Butterfly Garden. Any FFA members interested in participating in Ag in the Park on Friday, you should see Mrs. Lemner today, tomorrow at the very latest. If you had artworks in the Spring Arts Show, please pick it up 
from any of the art teachers as soon as possible. Work left behind after Thursday will become property of the Linmar Art Department. The Linmar Drama <laughs> Contest Speech and LMTV will be holding awards ceremony for to honor students who have been active in these activities throughout this year. It's Friday at 7 o'clock in the auditorium. That's the arts and clubs scene. Back to you. Thanks, Bargava. For lunch, it's the chicken patty sandwich. The other lines offer pizza, salads, and sandwiches. Your LMTV forecast calls for sunshine today with a high of 89. Tomorrow will bring mostly sunny skies and a high of 88. And Thursday will bring more sunshine and a high of, you guessed it, 88. That wraps up today's edition of LMTV News. LMTV is always available online. Just go to the Lamar website or check us out on YouTube. Join us again tomorrow. And make it a twin-tastic Tuesday, Lamar.